Michael, going back to, to the debt consolidation companies, I think that, you know, like Kelly talked about, the stigma of a bankruptcy, people think that's embarrassing. It's, it's, a, it's a failure. Uh, I, I didn't do something correctly. I didn't handle my money wisely. So I'm going to go under the cover tonight. I'm going to contact this third party, this debt consolidation company. Nobody's going to know about it but me and my family or me and my spouse or if you're single. And they're going to work it out for me. Now, how much money do you think they make oh. off of these cases it, it, because it, they're, they're able to run all these commercials all the time versus being able to, to pay an effective attorney to, you know, which is basically pennies on the dollar of what they're able to discharge and, and restructure and get their life back together. Absolutely. And it's, it's just a, it's a pit. It is a money pit. That it's a scam. Are, are, yeah, it's a scam. Yeah. That's, that, that's all there is to it. It's 100% a scam. What these debt consolidation companies are is they're a glorified middleman. They're going to go to you and they're going to say, hey, Chris, first we need you to go ahead and let, let you default on all of your credit cards. Then once you're good and defaulted, then we're going to try and come in and negotiate a deal with them. There's only one problem. They have no power whatsoever to force your credit card companies to work with you. They then force you to enter into this repayment plan with them that has them getting paid first, of course, right. and then gives a little bit to the credit card companies, hoping then that they're gonna release you. But then if the credit card companies release you, being that tax day is tomorrow, this is important for folks to know, your credit card company is gonna stick you with the tax bill for them writing off that debt. None of that happens in bankruptcy. Bankruptcy is far cheaper, and as far as being concerned about people finding out, I, there's an old rumor that says they run your information in the paper, and you know you, you go out at City Hall and people huck lettuce and tomatoes at you. It's not like that. I see that all the time down yeah. here at Avenue, yeah. actually. The, the <laughs> only people who will ever know that you filed bankruptcy are your creditors and the people you decide to tell.